What's happening, fam? This your man, Jay, and I'm in Orange, Connecticut at, look behind me, look out behind me, at the K-Pot, Korean barbecue and hot pot place. Over at this spot, you can actually um, cook your own food on the grill. They got like a little grill, I know. And you can also cook all your food in the hot pot, which is like a soup. Um, you can get everything um, separately or you can get everything all at once. So um, I think I'm going to try everything. Let's just try everything, get a little taste of it and see how you like it. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe for all this new juicy content. Holla. All right, y'all, I just wanted something a little more private for this beautiful, beautiful setup. Look at it. All right, I'm gonna give y'all, I'm gonna give y'all a quick look. How you doing, miss? You're my server today? Hey, how you doing? All right, um, what's your name, miss? Rachel. Rachel, thank you for taking care of me. I'm Jay. Hope you're having a great day. Yeah. Huh? This is all you can eat Korean barbecue and hot pot. You have two hours to eat as much as you like. And two hours? Yeah. I only got two hours to eat? <laughs> you Oh my, I'm really a slow fast. eater. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna need five hours. All right, no, go ahead. <laughs> so this is the, hot, the barbecue side. You just cook everything on here. Everything is raw. There's a guide on there to so see how much you need to cook it for. Oh, that's the guy. Okay, we'll we'll go back to that bad boy. Okay, my lady. So this is the price for lunch right now. Yay! You just wouldn't be able to have the dinner items unless you do upgrade to the dinner price. You would have access to all this menu right here. This is the hot pot side. Yeah. It's the same thing. As oh, the with barbecue. dinner, you got you can't get that good stuff. Yep. Or... <laughs> but we have seven different choices for the broth. Okay. You just have it right here, and you just Yay. put everything in there as well. Yeah, I'll do the dinner, twenty nine ninety nine. Get the whole the whole kebab. Okay. How? So you just let me know what soup base you want. There's seven of them. You just let me know which one you would like. So All I right. Take it down for you. Awesome. Try something I did never try before. See, so we're gonna try the Szechuan spicy. Cause we like spicy. All right. So the way that you order is all on here. Everything is on here. This is all for the hot pot. You click on what you want. It'll go to your cart. You press on the cart. And you press send order and it'll just come straight to your table. Once you see the little trash can is gone, that means your order went through. And then you can go back and order as much as you would like. This is all the hot pot and you can go down here. All right, so we'll hot beef all the way down. Everything, mm -hmm. boom. There's right. also a sauce bar in the middle of the restaurant that you can go grab make any sauce that you would like. And there's some appetizers as well. More food? Oh, my goodness. Hey, y'all can't go wrong with this spot. <laughs> Holla. All right, Rachel, thank you so much. Appreciate you. All right, that was a nice introduction. Our server was very knowledgeable of everything. As you can see, what you can get is you are able to get the soup or you can also get the choice of the Korean barbecue. So I got everything. I'm gonna try to try as many things as I can so you can get a taste of that bad boy too. Holla. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for all that juicy content. So here's all the spicy sauces. We can start with sour and spicy sesame, sweet and spicy sesame, sweet and sour garlic, and you can see from there all the other choices. The reason I, joined, I wanted to try this place out is because it was just different. I mean, I could have went and got me a cheeseburger or something, but I kind of wanted to have some fun with my food today. So y'all gonna have some fun with me, right? Holla. So I just went to make me make my own little sauce right there. Got some cilantro, some chili sauce, and I squeeze some lemon in there. Don't know if I'm doing that right. Now. Oh yeah. All right, so y'all know what I like. I love me, we'll do some tempura. Boom. Let's throw some tempura up in there. I'll do the tempura. And let's try the baby octopus. All right, so we're gonna try one and one of the baby octopus and the uh, tempura, I believe it's shrimp. So let's see what's up with that. So that's just for the soup here. For the actual barbecue, let's take a look. I'm a pork guy and a seafood guy, so I'm gonna give this, let me, let, let's see. We have sent the order in, so we're, wait, we're just waiting. Yeah, look at that. That place. smells look so good, up. I kinda wanna eat it right now. You can smell the spices. I can smell the little peppers in there. I wish I could get stuck. Oh man, that is a good base. Nice. See, I, I was trying to see, like, do I do I put it in here, put it in the soup, and drink it like a... Oh, how you doing, sir? 
Oh, right. Which one is this? Spicy pork roll. Look at that spicy pork roll. Thank you, good brother. Appreciate you. All right. So this is our first one. We're going to throw this bad boy right there on the, on the grill. Alright, so I think our, our pork is definitely done. That looks, look at those burn marks. Y'all know I like char. I love that char. Look at that. As long as you eat char in moderation. Alright. First taste of the spicy pork. Mmm. Look how that came out. And I can definitely taste the spice. It's juicy. It tastes like that chili garlic spice. Thank you, my lady. Like that chili garlic um, spice. Good for the Chinese place. That's a good taste right there. And not only is it flavorful, not only is it flavorful, look at the, the color and the tenderness. That's what's really blowing me away, how, how tender this is. We got more good, oh, my, not my goodies? Oh, we got some goodies. What we got here? That's tempura and your baby octopus. Hey, little buddy. This reminds me of the episode of The Boys when the deep had to eat his friend. Okay, thank you, sir. All right, look at that. So this is our baby shrimp right here. Baby tempura, that looks good. And we have the octopus. This is gonna be boiled into, into the soup. I think I see an octopus eye. Is that the eye? Oh, Lord. Let's get started with the baby octopus. See that? Stay with me. You gotta throw him in the soup. Don't cry. There you go. Try our shrimp tempura. Mmm. See that? It looks crispy right there. That's going in the soup. Holla. One minute, 37 seconds later. All right. Let's check on our friends in the hot tub here. Oh, look at him. He changed up. Oh, these are baby octopus for real. Oh, I feel bad. That really was a baby octopus. All right, here we go. Trying baby octopus. Mega chewy. Woo! I'll be honest with you, that was mega chewy, and I wasn't feeling that that much. It, it's just it's probably octopus, you know what I'm saying? I, I just wasn't feeling that too much. Let me try the shrimp that was thrown up in there. They made it to the top. This is shrimp, it just says tempura. I'm eating this incorrectly. You're supposed to eat this with the broth. So I have it with the broth right now. This is the tempura. Now it's tempura. I think it's just fried dough. Good. The tempura, is it just fried dough? What is? Yeah. That's decent. <laughs> no, I, the texture, I thought it was going to bite into like a shrimp. You know, yeah, tempura, like yeah. shrimp or something. That, I didn't know it was real baby octopus. Yeah. It kind of like shrivels up when you put it in the Oh, well? Yeah. <laughs> we have to do it. We have to do that. Do you order stuff for the barbecue? 
Um, pork. This was amazing though. Like this chili. Is it the pork? This is the uh, spicy one. Yeah. So tender. Do you eat here sometimes? Yeah, I eat here a lot. Oh, where, 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 what do you like to order? I like the smoked garlic pork belly. Can I get one roll? The beef Short rib? Yes. Can I do one order of those? Yep. Just that right now. Okay. I don't want to get too crazy. And what a lot of people do when they come here is they get lettuce. So you cook your meat, you cut it into like five pieces, and then you get the lettuce, you put it in the lettuce, and you add any other vegetable that you like or sauce. Oh. And you wrap it up and you kind of just shove it in your mouth. And you eat it like that. Do I get less from there? No, you get order it from here. Oh, oh the vegetable. Yeah, it's the gotcha. vegetable. All right, let me take a look at that, boo. Thank you. You're welcome. I have such the best server in the world. She ordered a short rib and I have the spicy shrimp pork belly. All right? Mmm, look at that. So we got our sake. Let's get a sip of this sake. All right, boom. So here's a sake right here. About to drop that just so you know sake does have a little <laughs> spirits in there <laughs> Woo. that's actually not bad it just has like a how can i describe that that taste of sake more like i i, I can't get it like it's a different flavor, man. That's like it definitely tastes homemade, like some moonshine, like some some type of moonshine. That's exactly what it reminds me of. Oh, we back, my brother. Oh, nice. Garlic smoke, holla. And this is your short. And it's the short rib. Mm -hmm. Thank you. May I ask what your name is, sir? Uh, they call me Big D. Big D. And what do you what do you do? You're dropping off all this good food. What do you do yeah, back there? Um, I'm basically a food runner. I've been here since they first opened. How long was that? In May. May? Oh. 2023, yeah. Oh, wow. Almost a year. Okay. Uh, almost. So, um, what are some of the... I, I got what I got, but what would you recommend if you brought your family here? <laughs> I would recommend the garlic shrimp. Okay. The uh, pork cheek. Pork would, cheek. Yeah, yes. Okay. So good. All right. And I would also recommend the um, the beef bulgogi and the chicken bulgogi. Man, you recommended the whole store, man. I pretty much experiment <laughs> here any chance I get. Yes, yes. Well, I, I hear you, man. It's, it's smelling good, and I can't wait to try those recommendations. Oh, of course. All right. I appreciate you, Big D. Yes, All right, sir. Big D. Hey, don't forget to check it out, man. Oh, of course. All right. I just got one of the recommendations. That's the garlic pork. How'd that look? How'd that look? Oh my goodness. Come on. Look at that. I'm gonna eat this right out the right out the K-pop though. I'm gonna eat it right out of it. It got a bone in it too. And that is the short rib. I think he had enough. This buddy right here had enough. Oh, ah. Ah. Now I could have ordered some vegetables and stuff, which I do have, which I do have. Holla. So she mentioned a piece of lettuce. What I can do. It is so tender. I'm ripping it right off the bone. So tender. All right, so I rolled it all up in. Looking nice. See that? That's a short rib. It has a nice sweet taste to it. Next time, I'm not going to use the lettuce because I just want to get right to the, I want to get right to the flavor. You know what I'm saying? Right to the flavor. I don't want to be playing around. Okay. 
Oh man, look at that, yo. That is not burned. That is like the sugar or something that they have on the meat that's actually getting um, heated up. And it looks amazing. I'll be honest with you, though, I'm not gonna be a soup person, so I think I'm done with the actual hot pot. I mean, it was fun while it lasted. I, I may sip on the broth, but I don't care to add any more. I don't care to add any more items to it. Just sip on the broth. The broth is pretty good. Mmm. Okay. All right. I didn't know they offered chopsticks. Do any of you know how to use the chopsticks? I'm a little good. Um, I practiced some years back. I'm not the best, but I kind of got a small gist of it. Holla. Let's try and get some of this rice looking kind of sticky, like a sticky rice. My daughter will be the envy of me. Here we go. So that is the garlic. I, bought, I got this the sauce on there. Got it with the chopsticks. Mmm. Squeeze some lemon in there. Mm. The scallions. Right. This got probably be my last thing, y'all. But overall, before we even get into it, this has been a very good experience. Right from the right when I pulled in, as soon as I walked in, looking at the ambiance, all the food that they offer, all the choices. I, it's a very highly recommended spot. And again, you ain't here cooking your own food. How much more fun could this be? Make sure you check out K-Pot over here at Orange, Connecticut. And you won't be disappointed. Bring that $35, try the soup, try the meat, try all that stuff. Bring your, bring your date, bring all that. Y'all will have fun. Bring your family. Y'all will have fun cooking all these things. And make sure you try some of this sake, baby. And until next time, I'm your man Jay. You have a great day. And that's what's good.